This video is going to talk about this isolation three port module for snow plows. Um, on the uh, schematic, uh, we wanted to point out that, um, let's see here, down here on port connector A, pin C, it's the module common in down here. And so, um, over on this side, we got port A. So here is here is port A. So we got ground coming in on uh, connector A, signal C. And then when we come up over here on uh, connector C, there's this switched um, VACC, or V like V auxiliary in. Uh, power and so that's basically uh, ports connector C and it's coming in it's coming in on connector C so port C connector C pin C um, we're putting 12 volts on there um, and then if I turn the 12 volts on and off you can hear it click that's this uh, basic uh, little relay here, which is providing the power to the uh, control handset. So what we have is, let's see here. Um, yeah, here's the uh, uh, connector C, pin C, switched uh, V, v uh, auxiliary, to this uh, relay coil and here's uh, on port A pin C the common mode coming in uh, to activate this um, relay once that relay is activated then then um, the control power in on port B pin F is connected over to port B pin C which is control power out which then that, that's actually going to power up to the handset. So in order to uh, um, get the uh, the three port isolation module to activate the handset, you have to plug in the, uh, the headlights um, because, let's see here, on the headlights, um, this is the ground that's coming in from the battery and that comes over to the headlight plug-in and then that wraps back around and comes over to the uh, the common in to energize the relay um, and then once that's energized it can start delivering power um, to the handset and get some control up and going um, once that's all been verified and then here's your battery right there where your battery uh, voltages are coming in. They eventually go through some connectors. And um, there's a 10 amp fuse there. That that has to be good in order to feed power into the uh, isolation module. Um, as well as there's CAN communication going over here to the handset. Um, that... that uh, can communication goes over here to the uh, the motor and the pump and stuff like that. So only four wires uh, needed to uh, connect up uh, over to the pump. So anyway, hopefully that's helpful information. Uh, once again, you need the auxiliary power coming in and the ground to come in to activate this particular relay which is i think it's k5 um these other relays are for uh bypassing the headlights and then these these uh vets over here are for the blinkers and things of that nature and then you've got some control logic here uh to communicate over the can bus i think that's uh potentially uh, maybe it's not can bus maybe it's just measuring some analog and digital control functions. Anyway, that's what's inside of this uh, um, 
three port isolation module. Um, anyway, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.